See, this is why I shouldn't do reactions to bands and have a massive break when they tell a massive story. Today's Patreon request is brought to you by Amanda, and we're back on 21 Pilots. They haven't brought out new music for ages, so I am looking forward to this. The song is called Overcompensate. What are we overcompensating for? Let's check it out. Like the start, anyway. What? Is that in French? That that sounds like French dialect. I don't speak French. <laughs> Different sound. Oh, well, first of all, great the way the way it built that up with the drum beat coming in was so freaking cool. But it said, "Welcome back to Trench, Trench, the album." Some great songs on that album. Let's go. If we continue in from Trench, then we're blurry face. Welcome back to Trench. Oh, go on, Josh, lad. This is a different sound, isn't it? Okay. Mm. Okay. I don't know what Salo Folina is, but I created this world. That sounds like godly stuff. Like I created this world, I can destroy it for once. You know what I mean? I feel, I feel like he's maybe talking about higher powers. He could be talking about the actual gods. It could be talking about anyone who's created. It could be. He could be talking about the world he's created with his music, like the trench and the blurry face, um, alter ego and stuff. You know what I mean? It could be anything. But I tell you what, this has got like a techno vibe to it. It just sounds cool. It's really, really, it's weird that the music's really, really quick and the, the voice is dead slow. <laughs> Let's go. And dampen. I don't know what that means. Right, I'm going to find out what Salo Felina is. I'm going to look it up, but when you get to the part where I've found it, I'll just jump to it because I'll obviously cut the, the blank bit out <laughs> right i want to know what that means before we carry on okay so it says here salo felina means to name <coughs> to enable expressive creations something that i just messed up because i couldn't express what i'm saying right okay so creation basically what he said before that right let's go <laughs> Oh, the vibe's changed. Wait, what? Wait, what? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Let me tell you about some of the lyrics. Earn my stripes, 300 tracks in my Adidas track jacket. Obviously, what he's wearing, he's, he's, he's earned his stripes in music, etc. Maybe this world that he's created is the world of, like, Trench or the, the like, say, the alter ego, like I said before. Okay, so I think he may be talking about his own music. I love this kick-ass style mask, but it's red. <laughs> you know, if you've ever seen the film Kick-Ass, you know what I mean. If you've not, you don't. But it, it, it looks cool. Tracks in my Adidas track jacket. Lowest brilliant. Be, hang on. Bless your ear holes while you're react acting. Bless your react. Is he talking about music reactors? And with the fact that we're acting. Don't hesitate to maybe overcompensate. Overcompensate, which means overacting, maybe. Is he talking about music reactors? 
<laughs> it sounds like. Okay. talking about his musical process sometimes it bends this way sometimes it bends that way you get your peripheral vision and suddenly you can you, everything goes clearer you know what i mean when you when you write because people get writer's block and stuff all the time that's what it feels like to me anyway now he's going the docks Wanted, he's wanted, dead or alive. I don't know whether that was a shout out to Bon Jovi or not. I don't know, but he's basically saying, "I'm here. This is where I grew up. I've grew up with my main man here, Josh, on the drums." So this is talking about this is all ours. This 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 world that we've created is ours, sort of thing. If you can't see, I am Clancy. Who is Clancy? What what's this? Is this, is this another story within Trench? Let me know in the comments. Right, let's go. And that was that, for that political half empty, half full, save half for your taxes. And what was it said before that? Oh, yeah, you, you bow to the masses, and now you pick who you serve. You bow to the masses. That sounds like that sounds governmental, or like obviously, obviously, because he's talking about taxes as well. But then you overtake yourself. Not sure. Let me know. Let me know what all, all that's about. But it sounds like sounds like someone who's looking up to a leader and then gets kicked to the curb, like he said. So you put your faith in somebody and then they screw you over. Is he talking is he talking like governmentally? Is he talking like you elect someone in, into power uh, with the promises of everything's gonna be cool, and then they just like, I'm in power now, so you can all go and do one sort of thing. Right, okay, I'm not sure. Pick who you serve, you bow to the masses, get kicked to the curb. Yeah, the the fact, glasses, though. Half empty, half full, save half of your taxes, then overtake your former self. This is a banger. Okay. That means drop the beat down a bit. It's a, like a, a, it's a weird visual mess with my mind here in this. The days are long enough, sort of thing. He's, he's not complaining about the length of the days, but the years are too short. It's like, well. How? <laughs> if the days are just perfect the way you like them lengthwise, how is the year too short? <laughs> I don't get it. Come on, Sal, you know we're screwing my head. Let's go. I like this bit. This chorus. What? The, what? We've got some alchemy going on here. He's he's turned into somebody else, like Houdini, and now he's at the side of a lake, an eerie-looking lake, like a horror movie-style lake, dressed like a part druid, part beanie at wearer. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. With uh, are they going to? This is. I feel like this is going to be more of a story. Yeah. There's going to be other parts. Oh, his eyes are orange as well. He's not got black hands either. Oh! 
Is he saying... Is he saying goodbye to Blurry Face? Because through that, he had the black neck, he had the black hands, and then when he went to this other scene where he's got like these the stag bones or whatever they are from, from the stag's head, and the, the boat came in, his eyes went from like orange to, to normal. He's not got the black on, on his neck, he's not the black on his hands, and then everything burned. So maybe he's burning the fear, burning blurry face. I'm not sure. Could be something. Do you know what? I'm gonna look at the song facts. I wanna know what the song. I wanna know what it's about now. See if I was right with like the reactors and then bowing to the masses, like like the the leaders that you put in power, sort of thing. Let's have a look what it means. See, this is why I shouldn't do reactions to bands and have a massive break when they tell a massive story, because I should have known that Clancy was um, Tyler. Right. Okay. The series revolves around a fictional word created by 21 pilots reaching a world city called Dima, ruled by oppressive bishops. I remember that now from the other songs. Um, and it's obviously it's continuing. Um, and they are it's got a surrounding valley known as Trench, which is the album as well. Clancy frontman Tyler Joseph's alter ego escapes from Dima by venturing underground in the, in the previous album. He did. And he, he's, he's trying to get his way back to Trench. Overcompensate continues Clancy's narrative, bringing him back to Dima. The title itself reflects the chap Clancy's desire for revenge against the bishops and the city's oppressive regime. Ah! <laughs> I should have remembered that. But then again, I didn't know it was following on from the last album. The lyrics hint at feelings of inadequacy. Inadequacy. And needed to prove himself, possibly mirroring anxieties that Joseph himself has faced with in the band's success. Okay, so the story was continuing from Trench. I'd forgot all about those bishops and stuff, but now it's all back in my mind. So on the next few songs from 21 Pilots, I will be well, well, well schooled on. Let's put it that way. What a brilliant song. No, what a great concept for the video. What a great, you know, the techno vibe and stuff. It was, uh, yeah, I enjoyed that. Different sound again from 21 Pilots. These guys are so different, so original. Anyway, what did you guys think of this reaction? Let me know in the comments. If you want to check out any more 21 Pilots reactions, there'll be a playlist right over there. Don't forget to subscribe, and I shall see you all in the next video.